Welcome everybody to Radio Free Tenacity, the voice of worker safety. Here today with Aaron Skemp, a key member of our Ergodyne Innovation Team. Aaron, thanks for joining us today, buddy. What do we have? Thanks, Al. Uh, we got a couple unique new knee pad solutions. Um, they are true strapless knee pads, so it's a knee sleeve is what we'll call them. Okay. Yeah, no, I mean, that's the first thing that uh, jumps out at me looking at these uh, two new knee pads. No straps, right? So it looks a little bit more like uh, something Steph Curry would wear, uh, kind of chasing down a loose ball rather than laying tile or, or yeah, whatever, absolutely. right? Absolutely. Yeah, and actually that's some of the inspiration we took was from the sports world um, where a lot of the knee pads are, are built for anti-impact. And what we try to do was take some of that inspiration of the sleeve concept and bring it in with um, some cushioning on the inside for those prolonged kneeling. Awesome. Awesome. So yeah, with the with the sleeve design, uh, obviously that looks like something that would fit your leg uh, pretty snugly. Um, is that something that you wear under your pants, um, under shorts, or can you wear that over your, your work pants as well? Yeah, so that's actually one of the uh, cool things about these designs is they're pretty versatile. Okay. Um, you can wear them over your work pants. You can wear them with shorts for some of those DIY projects. Um, it's really nice and comfortable, low profile. Um, one of the uh, cool things about the sleeve itself is the back panel is all mesh, so adding some extra comfort and breathability. Oh, sure. Yeah, yeah. Keep things cool. I could see that. I could see that. Awesome. And then I, I know one of the biggest complaints uh, workers have just talking to you around the office is uh, kind of keeping that knee pad in place, right? What do you what do you call it? Crawling From, out the front yeah, or yeah. falling out the side. Yeah, yep. yeah. Uh, so what are some of the uh, design considerations here? Obviously, you know, it's a it's a snug you know, sleeve. Yep. Um, but what other uh, what other things are built into the design uh, to make sure that doesn't happen? Yeah, so that was one of the key things we focused on when designing the knee pad sleeves were um, we added these silicone strips on the top and bottom to really keep that in place. Sure. Um, and then on the pad designs for both of these, we added these, they look like wings on the side. So when you actually wear it, it conforms to your knee nicely. Oh yeah. You um, so it moves with you. So when you're crawling, walking up and down, working on different tasks, it just stays in place. Right on. Well, I mean, all that right there would be enough to convince me to maybe ditch a traditional style knee pad um, for these. Now, would I be able to wear these knee pads in any application? I'd wear a traditional knee pad? Yeah, absolutely. That's another one of the cool things about speaking to the versatility of the product is um, both of these have very tough, durable, abrasion resistant outer padding, mm -hmm. um, but they also have, um, uh, they're also non marring, so they're, you can do some of those flooring, finishing type delicate applications as well. So it really spans a spectrum of different um, tasks. Got it, got it. So we, we've covered this sleeve design, kind of some of the applications. One thing I do notice uh, a difference on is the, the style of pad on each of these. So why don't you start out, you're holding the 550 yep. model right now. Uh, why don't you walk us through that pad design? Sure, so this is our more premium of the two options. Okay. Um, it's actually a three layer foam is what you're seeing here on the pad. That outer layer being um, a PU film, so that tough abrasion resistant uh, will hold up against any surface um, layer. Um, the thickness of it is a PU um, comfort foam. Oh, okay. um, and then on the most inner part of the pad itself is our neoprene comfort foam. So uh, that's what gives it that gel-like feel for those prolonged kneeling applications. Got it, got it. Um, and then moving over to the model 525, uh, tell us a little bit about that pad style. Yeah, so this is our lightweight version of the knee pad sleeve. Um, it's a EVA foam, really lightweight and flexible. We have this trihex pattern that moves with your knee and conforms to it really nicely. Uh, and then we use a abrasion resistant fabric. So we tested all sorts of different fabrics on this and we went with one that was really strong for those abrasive um, surfaces that you could kneel on. It tested to over 50,000 cycles on the Martindale abrasion tester, which is kind of an industry standard for fabrics, um, testing the strength of it. Okay. Not being completely familiar with the test myself, is that so that 50,000 number, I think you said, that's on the, the super high end? That's on the way high side of it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Awesome. Well, uh, again, I, you know, you're making, you're making a good case for these knee pads and uh, could completely see why I might want to convert to these. Um, and I know these are brand new to the market, but we 
do extensively field test uh, before we, we release our solutions out into the wild. So uh, just kind of wondering if you've had any feedback uh, from workers already on these. Yeah, well, these were actually built with workers. Um, okay. We do these voice of customer events and got all sorts of great feedback on how we build knee pads. And the number one complaint is straps for some of that uncomfortability that can come with a strap, either bunching behind your knee or the strap um, irritating your skin sure. yeah. uh, and things like that. So workers were in mind and along for the ride for designing these. Um, and some of the feedback we've gotten, uh, we've heard things like best knee pads I've ever had, or my favorite is I forgot I had these on. They're oh, so wow. comfortable, which yeah. is great feedback. That's what you want to hear. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Well, yeah, like I said, I, I think you've made your case here, man. Um, these, these look like two wonderful new solutions. Uh, hope to see them out on the, the work site, protecting a lot of knees here in the near future. Aaron, thanks again for joining us today. Thanks, and thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Stay safe out there, people.